As oil continues to gush into the Gulf of Mexico, another body of water has become just as treacherous. The Mediterranean Sea, the site of Monday's deadly clash between Israel and pro-Palestinian activists, is now being crossed by another ship loaded with aid for Gaza. With all eyes on Israel, the next few days are critical. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has said Israel was defending itself and called it a boat of hatred. But alienating countries like Turkey, home to eight of the nine killed, only makes Israel less safe. The Obama administration, which has backed the Gaza blockade, is starting to push for change. While Israeli officials say Gaza citizens have what they need, the blockade has become a recruiting tool for terrorists, just like Monday's raid. The challenge for Israel is to balance the need to protect itself while treading carefully to protect its relationships with critical allies around the world. That's a page from my notebook. I'm Katie Couric, CBS News.